so I guess that, that leads us on, you mentioned their MSPs, managed service providers, and we're seeing lots of interest from um, from organisations like that who maybe are not the tier one data centres, so you know, I guess we've got the, the public cloud providers, then in the UK we've got sort of uh, a number of tier one providers who, who are very well orchestrated at the moment, have, have built, built fantastic um, data centres that are very automated. But there's a level below that who are looking to to stay ahead really and maintain competitive advantage. Listening to what you've said today about how this gives flexibility and about people being able to um, just add additional resources and remove them, you know, let's go, you know, up compute goes yeah. up and down. Yeah. Um, you said that you deal with change. How do you help those managed service providers and uh, is that specifically a target market for you? Indeed, that's where I really were, as I said in the beginning, you know, that's where we start from. You know, we have seen is this great innovation coming from AWS and uh, Google, really, really revolutioning the way we are consuming IT. And those are the biggest cloud providers yeah. on the planet. Then you have all a bunch of smaller ones that if they are not innovating the way Amazon and the way Google is doing, they will be never, you know, competitive with them. So they need to have a similar technology that eventually Amazon and, and Google and Microsoft and other, you know, large yeah. enterprise they have in house because they have eventually hundreds of engineers. The smaller service provider, I mean, they don't have the capability to cope with these innovations themselves. So they need partners like us bringing them. This, this, this innovation, this new platform to make sure that they can be competitive from a technology perspective, from a cost perspective, you know, with the big players. Okay. That's really our, our the, be the beginning was our mission. Of course, among the, the, the while we have, we have been growing, we are also serving private cloud deployment with large yeah. enterprise yeah. customers that they want to behave eventually internally a bit like service provider. And the IT department, you know, serving the, the internal departments like customers. Well, that's so definitely the way things are going, isn't it? You, you, you hear these, the, the, the CIOs and CTOs talking about their customers and they are you know, departments within, within their organization. So having that flexibility to cross charge and say, you're using this resource and you're using this resource, Indeed. charging appropriately. Um, it, it's really important to them to, yeah. to get that budget and, and 